Well, at this time, the scene is clear. This Circle K gas station behind me, people are out here pumping their gas and the business is back open. But just an hour ago, crime scene tape was up and police were surrounding this area as they were investigating this shooting that has left one suspect injured. According to the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office, an officer noticed a vehicle matching the description of one used in robberies out of Claremont, Florida. This same officer noticed the suspect approaching the vehicle while walking his dog and the officer asked him to sit down. The suspect ignored the officer and tried to get in the car. Police say when the officer attempted to grab him, he got in the car and then pulled out a gun. That's when police say the officer fired at the suspect who was shot in the chest. Aid was rendered and the suspect was taken to the hospital. Bystanders that we spoke with tell us they were nearby when they saw everything unfold. We looked to the right and we seen four cops turned into six, turned to eight, turned to 11, 12. Next thing you know, we heard a pop, 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 pop. And all of a sudden we look over, squealing tires heading this way. And then we just sit there for a minute and maybe another 10 came down younger men. And the Jacksonville Sheriff's TK Waters also spoke tonight about how the officer handled this situation. Don't come to Jacksonville if you commit robberies because we're going to take action. And um, we're just happy that our police officer is okay because it could have been a very, very bad situation. That we are fortunate tonight that we're not dealing with a, with a critically injured um, police officer, but we are dealing with a critically injured, injured bad guy.